right, so I wanted to include this lecture uh, just for those who might not know where to get the latest Houdini build. All right, and so uh, what we want to do is we want to go into uh, a browser and we want to look up sideeffects.com. And this will basically be the start of where we can get the latest version of Houdini or you can go and buy a license because again the minimum license required for this particular course is an indie license of Houdini so um, I highly recommend to purchase one of those so you can follow along throughout the whole course okay so let's go uh, into our browser and take a look at where we get Houdini all right so uh, here I have uh, Firefox open here and I uh, opened up or I did a Google search for sideeffects.com all right, or you can just type in sideeffects.com and it'll bring this page up. And so what we want to do is we want to go and get Houdini. So you can go, if you don't already have a license, you can go and buy a license here. This is where you can find the indie version, okay? And when you do get the indie version, you also get a copy of the Houdini engine. All right, so that's a quite a deal in my opinion. All right, and it's actually really cheap. So I uh, highly recommend if you're an indie developer and your revenue is under 100K, I highly recommend uh, getting this because it'll really help you with your uh, indie game development uh, productions. All right, so uh, then if we want to go and get the latest, so let's say we already have a license, uh, let's go and get the latest version of Houdini. So this will be the uh, latest production build, okay? So as of this recording, um, it hasn't, PDG hasn't been released, 17.5 hasn't been officially released. And so um, when it does get released, this will be the latest version of 17.5. All right, so what you can do is you can go down to the daily builds too if you wanna stay up to date with all the daily builds uh, for PDG, okay? And so this allows you to go and download whatever the latest build is for today. All right, so today's 17.5.170. Alrighty, so that is where we do it. So you just click on, you know, whichever platform you're using. If you're using Linux or uh, Mac or Windows, you know. And so in my case, I'm using Windows. And so I would just go and uh, select this particular executable and it'll download for me. And then uh, we go and install it just like any other application. Okay, so let's go and take a look at that process as well. 